Yeah, I'm gonna have yours. Well, let's pop some stuff. Have a current fun this time. It's get a good windy day, good ventilation. Look at the Apache pops, but I gotta watch the smoke though. Then again, the neighbour used to have, he gets to know what his uh, fireplace in that shed makes lots of smoke, he doesn't get in trouble, so a couple of batch of pumps won't hurt. As long as the smoke goes away from the neighbours and they don't breathe it in, should be fine. I still have the tripod freeway. This wire sucks up some of the energy. It ain't good for the meters, this one. I'll shorten the wire down a bit. And bolts there. I don't know, I'll just see if I can get this heat stick to heat up. Melt that heat sink into hot. Another menu will take a while, a transistor. I should just blow up. A transistor there, I'll blow up. MOSFET. I could just blow it up. Have a look. I think it's a nice mark. Hmm. Let's go from the heat sink to one of the pins and that will work. Definitely would work. Popped it. Oh, I popped it. I don't know how much current that little thing can take. I took a fair bit of current to pop that little device. I uh, should do solder it. I've already damaged it with a um, mop anyway, so I can't really salvage it or use it for anything now. And pop the other one. I need my ESM for this. My ESM's got more current. I'll try my ESM. More uh, current and more voltage too. Blow some stuff up. <laughs> What's gonna blow up? Hmm. I can't get onto it though, can I? Can't get out of that one. Hard to get onto. They're super ca ultra caps, they don't get much of a run time out of them. They're flat next to no time, but they're good for cracking applications and stuff like that. Oh, there you go, try that. Like a blow up, blowing up every component linked to the ground of that heat sink. Yeah, blowing everything up. There's no grounding left. Yeah, she's all burnt out. I think I've totaled it now. Hmm. I haven't blown that transistor up yet. I 
Yeah. I might have blown everything up on that board. It's just all dead. Well, it's going to pop. Ah, oh, yes, the MCBF doesn't work properly if at all. <laughs> it chipped now, didn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah, she got smoky in there. <laughs> <laughs> that fixed it. It worked there, didn't it? <laughs> oh, she smells funky in there. <laughs> Bad the bloody thing out. Oh, yeah, she got hot and smoky in there. Hmm. See if I can manually actuate this thing. There we go. I managed to reset the breaker. It still works remarkably. It arced out. It's dead. Oh yeah. She smells funky. I think I just burnt the contacts out. The mechanical part still works. Either way, let's try it this way. It's dead. All oh, tops your time. It got hot, and then little thing you know, heats up, and the breaker, this thing here heats up, and Bob and strip is what chips it. That bottom tail strip has overheated the buggery. It's got hot. It got bloody hot. Hoo hoo, yeah, she got hot. That core will be interesting to burn out. Yeah, let's burn this core out. Alright, oh, I've got two things to burn out. Finish these off with a very round mop. Let's go. Oh, I'll jam these in. Come down there, and uh, one there. Best way to go about this is an easy now. It's difficult. To hold this in there. Difficult. Uh, Heat up now, see? Getting some current through there. <laughs> oh, mop and sandal. That one's gone. Then a coil. Still works, remarkably. I can now bolt this side on. I get the screws up and I bolt this side on. And I just sit down there and watch that coil smoke up. It's a solenoid. Finish this coil off. 60 amp coil that. Getting a little bit warm. Yeah, slowly heating up. Slowly, slowly.
Let's see if it smokes. It takes a while though. Here we go, she's complaining there. Oh yeah. Here we are. Probably should have kept it to make a core gun out of, but ah, uh, oh well. It's more fun than burning me out. I guess I can sit there happily all day and burn that coil out. <laughs> Haven't done a good burn out in a while. Boy, that's really it's not a burning warning. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. There we go. Might have been an ammo Plastic part of the solenoid there, the piston. Sixty amp breaker abuse. That's the part that mechanically chips it when the current gets overloaded. And that heat part's a heat that helps it trip. This magnetic uh, solenoid coil part was proven to be pretty tough. It's got a short out there, surely you shouldn't send it that. Mmm, yeah, start to see some enamel smoke soon. Glowing red hot a little bit. Yeah, it's a good thing about a low voltage. Slow burn out is the key for good smokeage. Nice, slow, steady burn out. Core's all short and red hot. <laughs> smoky, smoky. Man, it's gone off a lot, isn't it? Be a good smoky video. Oh yeah, nice and hot. Oh, look at it glowing. As for kind of introduction, we say, fag lot of anyone. <laughs> wow. That's looking like it's close to being solidified in the one solid lump of copper now. Yep, the wires. The wires are a lot. This is where the weakest part is. He's snazing at max. There we go, short to the body. What the current going in the coil? Yeah, see, so it's getting shorter. Wow, that's taking a while. Jeez, that's taking a while. There we go, popped. OC, open circuit. Here we are, that was a nice good burn out of a coil. But if you want to uh, scrap coils, you've got too many coils that you don't have a use for anymore, and you've got a heap of copper wire on hand that you don't really need, because you've got so much copper wire for making windings and condensing coils or whatnot, and you can sacrifice one coil here and there, just for scrap, for say, for example, it's a good way to burn that stuff off it for scrap, just burn them out. But normally I probably would have kept this for something, but yeah. Circuit breakers everywhere, you can get these out of circuit breakers, they're abundant, so all of them are different, of course. 
but this particular one here is a quite a commonly available one. Nice heavy duty coil. The metal part there, piston, which I won't touch because it's obviously going to be heated up. Now I've got the little terminal, um, terminal blocks there. Hmm. Anyway, that'll be enough for now. Thanks so much.